Today I'm going to teach you how to order encrypting POS. First you have to identify what type of service that you want to get into. We have table service, SAS service, and tab service. But for now we're going to use the table service. Of course you have to enter your access, info, uh, access code and you have to select the um, table the customer was set into. For the demo purposes, we're going to select the main one and you have to enter the uh, guest count. Okay, and it will give you in the right hand side right here, it will show the many groups and you can navigate it by clicking this arrow button in the upper right hand side. After selecting the many group, you can go ahead and click and, or tap the menus that you want to order. All right, and um, in lower left hand side, you can see quantity, delete item, special instruction, item discount. And the right hand side, you can send it to the kitchen, do a settle if you want to, print a receipt to void an order, to enter the guest count, to add a modifier, to edit a modifier, split and then split the check, or you can also enter the reference. So basically, after doing an order, all you have to do now is go to the home, home button. As you can see, the table turns out in green. It means that um, there is people currently dining in in table one or the main one. And after, if the customer decided to settle the transaction, all you have to do is select the table, the main one, and go ahead and click the settle button. This, uh, this uh, message right now shows that we don't have initialized cash rate. So what you have to do, go to home, and you need to go to cash rate and initialize the trade. Enter the code, open it up the drawer, and enter the amount that you have right now in your cash drawer. As for let's say, for example, you have 400 bucks, and now you are successfully initialized the cash rate with 400. Open up the table service again. Click the main one table and sell a transaction. Now, right now, it will give you a payment option: the credit card, cash, check, or gift card. And it will also give you an option to add a gratuity and also the sort codes to finalize the discount, the check, to remove a payment or override and uh, open the drawer. Okay, and we double tap this one, it will show you the receipt of the uh, transaction. To pay the um, tendered, uh, to tender the uh, transaction, all you have to do is select the payment type, for example, the cash, and um, this button right here will give you an idea how much, uh, how much the uh, total amount of the uh, orders. Okay, for demo purposes, we have to, we have to input a thousand, and it will give you three option right here to finalize the check, to print credit card if there's any, or you you do you do have a, a credit card transaction, print and close, of course, and for now let's go ahead and select finalize. As you can see also here, it's it's narrowing down how much uh, you're going to give back to the customer. Okay. So that's basically it. And now the uh, main one table turns white. It means that that table is already cleared out and uh, ready to enter a new order. All right. Thank you so much and um, have a good one. Bye-bye.